What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. We are long overdue for a bombshell review. Am I right? I have quite the healthy variety to share with you today. A nice amount of different styles. So I'm sure you guys will find something that you like. Really exciting news. I now have a bombshell support code. So if you use it at checkout, it doesn't give you a discount, but it does help go towards supporting this channel. It lets bombshell know I sent you there and hence keeping these videos coming your way. So if you'd like to see more bombshell and if you do make any purchases from today's video or future videos, then definitely use my support code to support this channel. You are new to this channel, or if you find yourself coming back to this channel often, why not just go ahead and hit that subscribe button? You won't regret it. We have a ton of fun videos coming your way. We're gonna be having Young LA featured on this channel soon for the very first time. I'm really excited to try them out. It will be my first time trying them and I'm really excited to share my thoughts. And of course we have some new Gymshark, Alpha Leap, some Buff Bunny. So definitely hit that subscribe button. You don't wanna miss out. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at what I have here in today's haul. So this is their scrunch thigh highs in neon pink. Do keep in mind these stripes they're satiny, so they shine. There's a little shine on your quads. And their glow sports bra in black. I tend to find the direct matching sports bra is always out of stock. So it's first come, first serve. But they are really good at restocking. I'm already seeing some pieces that were sold out that you'll see today. So they're really good about that. Now, before I get into the actual details of these pieces, I do need to confirm something here about bombshell sportswear. It's really meant for a particular body type. There's no, just no denying that. Look at their models that they use, for example. They're really curvy, small waist, big hips, big glutes. So right off the bat, I would like to see some more diversity. Momshell has this very particular material, which you will see in everything today. It's polyester and it's spandex. Right at the waistband, down till you get to the striped thigh highs, is that material. It's very thick. It's not totally breathable, but it does trap heat. It's very soft and very comfortable. It's also very durable, which is a big reason why the only sets I've actually actively worked out in at the gym were these sets with the thigh highs. A big reason is because right when it hits your thighs here, it turns into one big stretchy, breathable mesh. Even when you hold it up to the camera, you can see how tiny the waist area is and how the quads just pop right on out. So if you have bigger quads and glutes, you might really love these leggings. The length is very good as well. I'm five foot three. All of their pieces seem to come at a 26 inch inseam. So very comfortable on me. You do have two side pockets. I found that very helpful at the gym because I was able to put my phone in it, you know, walk around and not forget my phone on top of a random machine and then look like an idiot trying to retrieve it. Another thing I like about the pockets, when you put your phone in it, it doesn't weigh down the legging. It really tightly holds it up against your thighs. Doesn't move around, budge. If you're walking on the treadmill, it's not shaking around. Now, when I first put these leggings on, I did feel the seams right here. You will feel it because the seams are pretty thick inside. I'm really glad they didn't put any seams over the kneecap because then we would have had a real issue and I wouldn't be able to work out in them. When I was on the leg press, these held up great. I wasn't feeling the seams anywhere around my joints, so I was able to move freely. The signature bombshell scrunch. We all know about it. Do you love it or do you hate it? Now I have to admit, their scrunch is at the upper half of the glute seam. It actually sits at my tailbone. Luckily, these are black leggings. You don't see it. It's not like anyone's gonna be like, oh my God, look at that. That doesn't even do, that's not where it belongs, girl, what are you doing? For me, it was all right because no one could see it on this color, but do keep that in mind in lighter colors, which you will see. Now there's no denying, Bombshell's a little on the pricey side. Right, on the spectrum of affordability meets super high end, they're like, they're right on the brim there of being pretty expensive. But I do have to say, given its price point, the quality is there. Overall, very moderate compression, didn't dig too much in the waistband, even though it looks super tapered. I managed to work for me. I would say it's very true to size. If you're in between, you could get away with sizing down, only because I do think there's a lot of room in the glutes and the quads. So like I said before, the matching sports bras notoriously out of stock. So I always have to just grab a basic like solid color. This is their glow sports bra in black. This is my true size small, works pretty well. 
if you're in between size down. What I notice about Bombshell's bras, they typically have thick straps. So it is very comfortable to wear. The straps are very stretchy. You can see their elastic bands. They are adjustable, light to moderate support. This bra has a really cute cutout right in between the chest. Removable bra pads and a very small thin elastic band at the under bust. I think this is a great basic bra. It is made out of that thicker material, so do keep that in mind. I get a lot of Buff Bunny vibes when I'm really feeling around on this bra. It does have that thicker material, just like Buff Bunny does. Overall, just a basic black bra, easy to mix and match. It does cross in the back. If you're somebody who needs low to moderate support, but the big takeaway being oh, those straps just need to be comfortable for long wear, then definitely try this one out. Next up, let's take a look at the pocket pop legging and two-way bra in the color caramel. I did a little mini review of these leggings on YouTube Shorts. The response was great. You seem to really like them and I don't blame you. They're super freaking cute. These sold out. This color in particular is sold out. I hope they restock, but last I checked, they do have a nice blue color and pink, I believe. Those were actually restocked today. Just got that email, so check those colors out. And the pocket pop legging. This just seems a bit more cargo, wear out and about. I mean, you got pockets on the back. Like, I don't wanna sit on a leg press with some buttons on my bum. That might hurt. Now, these are both in my true size small. Perfectly okay. I think when it comes to the bottoms, you could get away with sizing down, especially if you're in between. I feel like these are the perfect dress up or dress down basics, athleisure, you can walk out, put on a cute pair of flats, throw on a hoodie even. These are gonna be my go-to for fall time. Now the pockets on the back, they are real. They do snap shut. You do have a really pretty V seam outlining the glutes. I'm telling you it really is a pocket pop because it will make your glutes pop. My glutes look pretty stellar in it if I do say so myself. But yet again, they added that scrunch right up here. That is the one thing I would have changed about this legging is just get rid of that. I feel like the actual material does it enough where it just works around the glutes, molds to you nice and body fit as it should. Me personally, I don't think this scrunch is very needed, especially when it doesn't sit in between where it needs to be and it's just really full on display. Other than that, the material is very stretchy, very comfortable, four way stretch, move around perfectly, all day wear, absolutely. I do really love and appreciate the fact that it is completely cellulite friendly. It's also camel toe friendly. As long as you wear your undies like you should, you're okay. Now, if you look closely, a lot of their material has that moral breakup. This is no different. It is a pretty heavy moral too. It's not faint like, is that moral design? No, it's, it's there and you can't miss it. For fashion purposes and dressing this up for the full, I'm down for it. And do keep in mind the seams here, all right? This is not seamless, very comfortable. They are flat lying seams. You don't feel them on your skin. They feel great. Now, I did get the matching two-way bra. This is reversible. You can wear it two different ways. You can wear it crisscross, just so, or you can turn it around. There you'll see the bombshell emblem, a little cut out neckline, really pretty. No matter how you wear it, it really does look cute. This is very low support though. Keep that in mind if you have larger breasts. I don't think that the underbust seam will lie underneath your breast where it belongs. You might notice it kind of riding up and then you're like, ooh, falling out from below. This is fine without bra pads. I think this material is thick enough. It's medium weight where you're not going to see any crazy nip action. You know what I'm saying? Other than the fact that you can style this two different ways, it is not adjustable. Yet again, they hit you with the really thick, comfortable straps. I would not want these to be thin. They'd be choking me out hard. Overall, very true to size. I would stick to my true size small all over again. In between, I mean, I would say if anything, size up only because I think it could run a little bit snug here, dig right here in unwanted areas, creating that extra bulge. So in between, size up. Let's move on. Introducing the form bodysuit. Shorts, okay, because they have two different versions, leggings and this one, you'll see. Now, the first time I tried it a month ago, I ordered the really bright pink color in my true size small, but I noticed that up top it was really big and awkward looking. 
but everything else fit okay. But Bombshell knows best. They saw it on me firsthand. They were like, girl, size down. So my extra small mwah, fits just as it should. This material is super forgiving. Again, four-way stretch. So it really did keep that glovey dubby fit without riding up or being uncomfortable in certain areas. Some perks about this bodysuit, you do have a built-in bra, removable bra pads, same material like you've seen, very nice and thick. And these straps are adorable. So basically it branches out right here into two different straps on both sides and then crisscrosses in the back. So you have a ton of beautiful straps down the back. Very, very stretchy, very soft. They don't make marks on your back. They're very comfortable for all day wear. The one thing I need to let you guys know, it goes so sexy low in the back that you need to actually wear low rise undies. I didn't and I wore my high rise thongs and you can see it. <laughs> I actually had a question from a gal. She DM'd me the other day asking if people actually wore bodysuits to the gym. Do I personally see anybody wearing bodysuits to the gym? My answer to that is actually yes. Literally the other day, I don't know what brand she was wearing, but she was on the treadmill and she was wearing a bodysuit, one piece. It was pink, it was cute. Kind of similar looking to this, but it didn't look like the same material. It looked a bit thinner. But I have not seen anybody wearing long legging bodysuits, which you're about to see in a sec, but the shorts I have seen. I think the sweat, it's gonna be decent with concealment because it's so thick and the moral design really helps that. But I do believe you're gonna feel that sweat. If you're a heavy sweater, it will feel a bit soggy because of the material. That's just how it is. Other than that, squatting down, these shorts do not roll up. And the best part is they did not add that scrunch on these. <laughs> I'm so happy to see that. That was a saving grace here. But yet it still molds so perfectly around the glutes. While we're on the topic of bodysuits, this is the regular form bodysuit, the legging version. This is in the color port, so it's almost a wine red meets purple, really dark, deep, almost burgundy, but it's more on the purple side. This just screams fall to me. I plan to dress this up with a beige cardigan, some moccasins, that kind of thing. It already has that cozy feel to it. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna wear. The same exact deal as the shorts version you just saw, same strappy back, Still gotta wear the low rise undies or else you're gonna be showing off the undies to the world. Same exact fit. I sized down to an extra small, even with the leggings, it fit absolutely beautifully. In case you're wondering about the built-in bra, it is a full on shelf bra, all right? So there is a nice decent amount of support in this area. If you look closely on the midsection of the bodysuit, you will see a silhouette contour. There's some seams that actually contour your midsection grab in the material so it doesn't just hang straight down and make you look boxy. That I like. They really thought out some details to make you just pop and look curvilicious. While we're on the topic of this port color, <laughs> I actually grabbed a port set. We're looking at the Brazilian contour leggings in extra small, I sized down in these, and the Ace sports bra in my regular true size small. Now let's start with the leggings. These leggings actually have a crisscross V waistband. So I'm starting to really love that V waistband because it makes my short torso appear longer. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty much it. I know it's hit or miss for a lot of people. If you deal with a lot of rolling around with the waistband, you might wanna not gravitate towards a V waistband. Yet another layer of sexiness that Bombshell likes to add. And then they went a little too sexy on the back with that scrunch bum again. <laughs> again, it's a darker legging. I don't notice it. I Trust me, I tried to look at it from behind. It's not really visible on this dark of a legging. Very, very squat proof in this dark color. This is pretty much that bodysuit legging you just saw, except it's a legging and it's got a V waistband. Pretty much the same exact thing though. Now being that this material is the same as what you've been seeing in these other pieces, there's not a whole lot to go over. It's just different styles, okay? V waistband leggings with a little built-in scrunch bum. Bombshell seems to just have more of a consistent feel to them when it comes to their material, even their inseams. Everything's pretty much 26 inches, so pretty consistent. So I paired it with their Ace Sports Bra. Now this is ultra sexy because you have a really stiff V cutout right in the front. So it goes fairly low, holds the girls nicely. This I'm giving a very low support because you do not have a band, nothing down here, no elastic band that's actually holding at your underbust. You still do have removable bra pads. And of course they hit you up with those thick straps again. You have a really pretty crisscross backing and then right at the bottom, a very thin strap. Even though there's no support at the underbust, I still tested it out. 
raise my hands up and down. It doesn't shift or move around, so it's still holding its integrity. Last but not least, we're gonna take a look at the V scrunch leggings and the laced up crop bra in the color baby blue. First things first, this is sold out. And it's been, like when I first got it from them, I went straight to the website and it was sold out immediately. So this is a newer release of theirs. Check out that V waistband. Not only do you have the V waistband, but it's a different style than what you just saw. It doesn't overlap, but instead it's connected with a ruching right in the center. This is different. I haven't seen this before on any other legging. Now that does have two side pockets, which are lovely. The scrunch on the back, which I could do without. I'm not gonna go into that. Now this is in my true size small. I'm okay. I can go either way with small or extra small. I think when it comes to the bodysuits, that without a doubt has to be an extra small, but I do believe small or extra small in the leggings work fine for me. This is definitely a cool tone blue. So you have the baby blue with some dark gray marl throughout. The laced up bra is super cute. You do have a nice laced up front. It doesn't untie or anything, it's just as is. I'm so glad that it doesn't because I would have messed it up a long time ago. The lace would have gotten stuck in my dryer somewhere. So it stays intact as one piece. Again, with the thick straps, non-adjustable. It is a racer back style. And again, you don't have any underbust support, all right? There's just a normal seam. There's no elastic band. So again, I'm gonna go ahead and say, this is more on the low support side, low to moderate. Now, if you're anything like me, I tend to overheat at the gym. Less clothing, the better. Like I put my hair back. I don't really like the feeling of just being too hot at the gym. So I need something a little more breathable, which is why I got away with the thigh highs because half that legging, more like 75% of that legging was a breathable mesh. When it comes to this type of material, it's not my preference to work out in this type of material. It's a little too thick. However, you can still technically work out in these pieces. They are comfortable, they are durable. If that doesn't bother you and you're like, damn girl, I would love working out in this material. It's comfy and it really is a body fit secure fit, then yeah, go ahead, work out, have a ball. I'm sure you're gonna love it. For me personally, I need a little bit more breathability in my sets and there's nothing wrong with that. All right guys, so that concludes today's bombshell video. What are our thoughts? Comment down below. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful. Let me know if you'd like to see some more bombshell hauls. Me personally, if I had to pick one piece out of the bunch, it's the form bodysuit. I can't pick the shorts or the leggings because they will be for different seasons, but the form bodysuit is my favorite out of all of them. So I do believe that these new bodysuits they just came out with will probably be a hit for me. And of course, the thigh highs, they're classic. They held up really great in the gym. So overall, very happy with this haul. We got some really solid pieces here. The quality is amazing. I think if they just lost that scrunch, we'd be, we'd be really good to go. Or at least update it. Now, just try something new. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful. Thank you so much for watching and do not forget to hit that subscribe button on your way out. I love you guys so much and I'll catch you in my next video.